Well, Alex Peru, and what we know, want to know about you is zipchipsports.com. You're on Kickstarter now and just selling the hell out of this thing. Everybody wants one of these. And when you watch your video, I mean, you can't help but want one. I'm going to get some. I, 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 my older boy, I mean, my younger boy would love this. I'm going to get the three pack so he can have it with friends. Man, it's something that anybody could play anywhere. I mean, it's just like the size of a baseball, but it looks more like a frisbee. And you can throw it like a baseball and it just goes. You can throw it 200 yards. Without any effort at all, <laughs> I could never throw a baseball effort. I could hit. That means I could throw into the shortstop very easily from second base. And an old guy like me, I can't do that anymore. But I can do it with your thing, right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. No, it really is. I mean, um, you, that was a great analogy between it being a kind of a cross between a ball and a frisbee, and that's really what we think of it as. You know, it is thrown more like a ball, but it flies more like a frisbee. And, uh, it, you know, for that reason, we kind of think of it almost as like the, the missing link in the evolution of... Uh, of so the, you can catch it. You don't need a, you know, a $200 glove to catch no, one of these. <laughs> no, it's, it's, all, it's all in one fun. You know, it's, it's absolutely... Uh, it's and you can dive for it like a Frisbee. I mean, again, your, your video shows all these people that are having so much fun doing it, man. I can't believe it. Because it floats a little bit in the air. And so, you know, you, you, it's easier to catch. Than a, a baseball or something coming at you 90 miles an hour. You know, it's definitely not going to hurt when it hits you. That's for sure. <laughs> that you'd be afraid to catch it. You just let it go by. Yeah? Even, even a frisbee can be a little, a little daunting yeah. coming in, coming in hot because it, it weighs a lot. This thing uh, weighs under an ounce, so it's, it's. Oh wow! So yeah. this is lighter than a frisbee, softer oh, than a frisbee. <laughs> you know, it's. I mean, it's. It's actually uh, to get specific. It's a, it would be a little heavier than a frisbee if you scaled a frisbee down to the exact same size. I see. But uh, because it's only. Uh, a fraction of the frisbee right. size, it's it is still a fraction of its weight. And you can take it anywhere and put it in your back pocket like a phone or something, and you have a toy here. <laughs> you know, if you look at all the other things you play catch with, you know, the baseball and gloves. Right. Football is large. A frisbee is flat but still huge. Uh, this thing you can put in any pocket. Wow. Uh, play catch, you know, whenever you want and wherever you want. See, what you need is a stand down in the mall. They have big, lots of Frisbee games down in the mall oh. in Washington, D.C., you know. Absolutely. And if you were selling these things, and, you know, I mean, they're less than 10 bucks. Actually, on the Kickstarter, they're only $7. And, and if you buy the pack of three, you get them for a little over $6 a piece, man. <laughs> yeah, no, that's right. I mean, it, it, if, I think that's honestly, uh, that's probably where we're going to go with this. At some point, try to get it in front of people that can buy it in person. Right. I think it looks good on the video. <laughs> it's twice as good when you see it. You know, whizzing through the air because it's like you know. I, I think it still harkens back to the uh, things that you said about it. It, it. You throw it more like a ball, but it flies more like a frisbee, so people can relate to it. But uh, it, it's still new to them, so it, it's got a great. And the value. most amazing thing to me is that you're in the fishing business. How the hell? I mean, you're not going to catch fish with this thing, but you no. just love sports that's, so much. <laughs> that's true. You know, uh, you know, the fishing business though, I did get to apply a little bit of the design. Uh -huh. um, technology that I had learned there as far as different resins and different tooling. Oh, really? Wow. That. So there was, uh, as far as coming up with this, um, with the prototyping process, in the zip chip here, I, I definitely had uh, I, I had some inspiration in, in the fishing thing. It, 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 so it, in your fishing business, you supply product to fishing gear to all up and down the East Coast, right? For Yeah, that's right. So, uh, you know, we have a about about 50 distributors we sell wow. to uh, up and down the coast, and you know those stores uh, then again go ahead and sell to the public. So with the zip chip, you know this is the sort of product that uh, you know we're, we're we're trying to find where where exactly it will fit in because those stores won't be able to carry it. Right. They do certain. Well, maybe I could see somebody, you know, guys going on fishing. Hey, you know, they play catch, and you know, it's a a little toy. But I mean, that's what I have in mind mostly. A bunch of guys going fishing, you know. Yeah. And, no, and guys great. like to do sports too, and they don't want to bring bats and balls and all this kind of stuff. I would say so. You know, if you were to be fishing with a bunch of guys, and uh, <laughs> I hadn't even considered it, but that's a great idea. This is probably the only thing you could play catch with. Yeah. At right. the same time, you were going fishing. Right. And then even if you're fishing on the boats, and it's floating. Yeah, you know, everything else. <laughs> <laughs> well, boat to boat, absolutely. Yeah. And then even if you lose it, that's oh, seven bucks. You know, it's not like a football. You have 30 bucks or whatever, 50 bucks, you know, or something like that. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I, that makes sense to me because it's mostly guy thing, and most of this will probably be guy stuff. Yeah. I would say so. Yep. Yeah. I mean, you know, you know girls can uh, – you know, they, they, they can do it, but uh, I, I, would, I would agree that, that uh, the guys... But, are, I mean, now I see a lot of women playing Frisbee down on the mall. I mean, there, right. there's co-ed teams, so I, I would imagine same thing with this. Yeah, an athletic girl that likes to, you know, be outside and right. 
throw things around as a girl who, you know, yeah. some of them like, like it and some of them don't. So. Right. No, I mean, this is maybe there's title line money for this, you know. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, you're from UConn. You know about how good girl basketball players are. So. <laughs> you got that right. They all, they all get free zip chips if they want them. Right. So they could be you know, the uh, chip it. And then soon it'll be the Olympics. Man, this is the cheapest Olympic sport in the world, right? If you... <laughs> that's true. I know that's why we'll probably get countries from all over actually having a chance at this one as opposed to ice hockey. <laughs> got. Because size doesn't matter, right? <laughs> no, absolutely. Which is why, you know, honestly, you know, if we were to, if we were to, if it was to come into a game, um, I was, I was thinking about, you know, how the zip chip could be transferred, right. into the game. that's something we're still working on. So anybody who likes the zip chip just for throw and catch, um, if they have any ideas for, for a game. I'd like to see that turned into a game, or they can invent their own game yeah. because it's not limited just to one. You know, you can, well, you can, what is it? I mean, the frisbee. I mean, I want to play. Watch somebody. What do you call that frisbee yeah, game they play? What? Ultimate. Ultimate. Yeah, ultimate frisbee. Man, I mean, that, that, that's like football, going up and down the field and passing Absolutely. the thing. So we could do with that little thing and make longer passes. <laughs> we definitely play. We, we've we've done a few pick up uh, ultimate games with the, really? the chip. So it's yeah, well, it's there. Well, you're a delight, and thanks for doing this, Alex, because I think you got a great pocket toy for anybody now. And to the kids, see, kids can put this in their knapsack and go to school and then have a game to play with at school. They always have waiting at the bus stop. They could be throwing this back and forth and helping them. And, and even, see, this is something for, like, you know, the coaches to give their kids to practice <coughs> so they don't have to practice with a hard ball. They, That's they true, yes. The well, hand-eye coordination. Absolutely. If you're if you're looking for something like you said, eye hand coordination, something yeah. to dial in your skills, this will right. this will put them to the test. So I, I agree. That's that's a great application yeah. for it as so well. So you could start your two year old now with yeah. one of these things. Start catching them. Yeah, right. they'll, they'll think it's a chew toy, but you know they'll they'll <laughs> that as well. Well, thank you so much, Alex. And it's Chip. I mean, zipchipsports.com. Z i p c h i p s p o r t s dot com. See, I flunked English in college. I'm like, oh, that, you have a package there? Show a package. Yeah. So this is one of the prototype of the packages. Yeah, that's a cute package, man. It's nice. That's... So we're working. On, we're working on getting it dialed in just for you know our yeah. our, our backers and, and going. Can full you show time. it? Yeah. See, yeah, it, it looks like that's how you would hold it. You know, throw yeah, it like a baseball. Here. It's a sidearm throw. It's it's a forehand sidearm throw. It's not backhand. Yeah. Great. Zipchipsports.com. Alex, keep right. fishing, keep throwing. Thanks, Matthew. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.